How are you? Hope all is well with you guys. Um, I want to do a giveaway for you guys. I am almost at one year of having my channel. Um, and I am just flabbergasted at the amount of support I've had from you guys and the amount of love that you guys have showed me. Um, so I want to give back to you guys. Um, we have a lot more to go. We have a lot more you know, things to share. And I love the uh, community here. I love you guys. And you guys make my day. You know, when I come in here and I do these videos for you guys, I just feel as if, you know, you guys are part of my family. You know, um, the beautiful comments that I get from you guys and things. So this is to me, from me to you. Um, remember guys, this giveaway, you have to be subscribed to my channel. Um, and if you want to enter my giveaway, you need to write down in the comments, um, that you are interested in here, write your, your name and say that you're interested in stuff. You have to like this video. You have to be subscribed and you also have to put down in the comments, um, that you know, you are interested in this. Okay. So I will be giving away and I might do a couple more giveaways too, but this is what I'm going to be giving away. I'm going to be giving away the, um, the mystic shaman Oracle. Okay. And this is a beautiful deck. Uh, I love this deck. This is, um, by, uh, one of the greats, um, Colette Baron Reed. Uh, I love her. It's also by Alberto Vill... Vill... I can never say his name. Villo Lado and Marcellus Lolos. And this is, um, it is, it has the deck and the guidebook. It, this is an unopened deck. I have not opened this deck. Um, this is a Hay House deck. And, uh, this is, it's right around $40 if you were to go out and buy this. It is a 64 card deck. Um, so there's 64 illustrations in here. Um, they're beautifully illustrated. Um, absolutely beautiful. Um, even if you're not into the tarot and you don't do readings, this is a beautiful deck just to maybe uh, reflect on to maybe just do some shuffles and just pull a card, you know, at random and see what it says. And it can give you so much insight into yourself, so much insight into the things that, um, that, you know, that you might want to look at and kind of look at yourself, do some self healing. Um, the back of this says, uh, legends say that before there was time, before there was language, there were the sacred symbols, the medicine wheel, the curse, the eagle, the jaguar, and others spoke to us intimately. In their countless manifestations, they offer hope, expressed caution, illuminated opportunity, inspired creation, courted power, and shared knowledge. The sacred symbol belongs to the realm of archetypes and the collective unconscious, the spirit common ground shared by people modern and ancient. Um, now the three masters, teachers, and healers have brought their wisdom and talents together to offer a doorway into the realm of the sacred symbols and uh, with the, the mystic shaman oracle. When you consult the oracle, you summon power and insights that help you understand the present, heal the past, and influence the course of your future. 
We can become our own prophets and visionaries. We can converse directly with spirit, dialogue with the forces of nature, speak with the great archetypes, the ancient gods, without <coughs> intermediaries. No one needs to stand between creator and you or between you and the great power of nature. So guys, this is my giveaway to you. Um, I love you guys. I This is, like I said, you guys are amazing and awesome. And I love, love this channel. I love what we've become. I love, love what we share. And um, without you guys, I wouldn't have a channel. So this is my gift to you. So remember guys, make sure that you are subscribed to my channel because you will not, um, unless you are subscribed, you're not uh, eligible to enter into this giveaway. Um, remember to like this video, okay? You have to like this video, you have to be subscribed, and you have to put down in the comments um, that you are interested in this, uh, you know, receiving this Oracle. Okay, and then I will do the drawing in about a week and we will see who wins. Okay, guys, I love you. Hope you have a wonderful day. And remember, God bless. You know, you just thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for everything that you do. Mm. Bye, my loves. Hello, my loves. How are you? Hope all is well with you guys. If you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you are returning, welcome back. <clears throat> Today, I'm going to be doing a reading. And this will be your weekly reading. And this will be for my cancers. So, I hope you guys all had a beautiful week. It's been beautiful here in New York. The weather is fantastic. Um, it's been in the 70s. Um, just, you couldn't ask for better weather. So, and it's going to stay like this for about another week. So, I am quite happy with that. So, everything's been going, going fantastic. So, we're going to give these three more shuffles and we'll get on with your reading. Two. Uh, two more. One more. Angels, guides, and spirits, what is it that my cancers need to know for the week of the 8th through the 14th, please? Looks good so far, guys. Okay. Um, this week is going to have to do with your emotions. Okay? So, your emotions are kind of going to be running high. Um, it also could be something to do with water. Okay? So, <clears throat> we have the fish. And the fish is all about your emotions. So I feel as if it has to do with your emotions this week. So you might be a little bit up and down with your emotions this week. Um, we also have the dog. And it's all about um, companionship and loyalty. Right? It's about um, man's best friend. Okay? So you're going to have those that loyal, loyal person in your life this week that um, that is like your best friend. That, um, you know, things are looking so that those friends of yours that are loyal are going to be helping you coming your way this week. And then we have the cup. And the cup is all about prosperity. Okay, so prosperity is coming your way. It can also mean a pregnancy. So um, if you've been looking at uh, friends maybe uh, that have are, you know, you might 
might be looking at some kind of pregnancy of friends or maybe you could get pregnant or uh, your significant other. So it could be in pregnancy, but I don't feel as if it's pregnancy. I feel as if it's more prosperity um, because you also have this protection. So you have protection coming this week. You have lilies and lilies all are all about those, um, that renewal and that peace. So that peacefulness and that renewal will be coming to you this week. Um, we also have the knife. And the knife is about um, some kind of anger. So you're feeling angry about something this week. Um, you have a little bit of anger. We have healing with the plague doctor. So you're going to be healed. Things are going to be starting to come your way. Things are going to start to heal. And you have that protection. So everything will be coming your way. We also have uh, that crown is all about um, business success. It's about having royalty. So your money finances are going to be looking up, right? Because we have the cup. We have that royalty. So business, business, um, your money, things like that are starting to look up a little bit. Um, and it will be doing very well. You have that protection that's coming in um, with the plague doctor and also the horseshoe. So you're going to be protected this week. You have that beautiful, uh, royalty, uh, or loyalty, beautiful loyalty of things. Your emotions are going to be on the little up and down side this week. Um, you have those beautiful fond memories. Um, you have that, uh, that, renewal and that peace. So you're going to feel, feel peaceful this week. Things are going to be, uh, you know, your emotions are going to be a little bit up and down, but you're going to be, feel peaceful about it. Things are going to start um, feeling peaceful, but watch out for a little bit of anger on your part. Um, I feel as if you need to kind of watch your temper a little bit this week. Okay. So that is what I have for you on my cancers. So let's give these, thank you, angels, guides, and spirits for that reading. Um, let's ask the universe what it is that you need to know, what they want to tell you. Universe, what is it that cancer needs to know for the week of the 8th through the 14th of November, please? more shuffle. You don't need that many cards, universe. Let's pick some of these cards up here. I gave me like 12. That's a little better. Thank you. That's better. They want you to celebrate this week. The dance for celebration. Um, the spring equinox is all about rebirth. So things are going to start changing. There's going to start coming your way. Um, you're going to be reborn. And then I have the volcano. Watch a volatility. Watch out for eruption. I mean, don't let things get to the point where uh, you just blow. Okay, so, um, you know, be a little bit more volatile towards things. Be a little bit more calm towards things um, this week. So they're talking about celebration. So celebrate this week. Uh, that re rebirth is coming. But watch out for that anger a little bit. Okay, so I hope this helps you guys. Remember, guys, this is a general reading, so it may not resonate with all of you. So be sure to check out your sun, your moon, and your rising readings also. I love you guys. I hope you have a wonderful and an absolutely beautiful week. And until next time, bye, guys.